Christina here. Hey, um, I just wanted to show you guys um, a tour of my backyard um, and future plans of what we plan to do. Um, I kind of just wanted to make this video to kind of give you guys an idea of what our backyard looks like. Um, I don't know, we spend a lot of time outdoors and we have a lot of ideas in the future what to do. And so I just thought I'd show you guys what's going on around my house. <laughs> so come along with me. Here we go. These guys won't stop crying. You guys want to say hi? Oh, they think we're going for a walk. We're not going for a walk. Okay, so when we come out, you guys might have seen this in the previous video. Um, this is my breezeway. Pretty kind of boring. I mean, there's nothing much to it. We used to have a wall right here where this board is. We used to have a wall right here, like a screened in door to make it more of a breezeway. But it kind of got annoying because it just trapped in flies and the dogs were breaking the screens anyway. So we just left it like that. And then out... See, right here is where I come out from my, my house, and then that's to the front yard. And then this is my garage. And in the future, I do, we don't really use our garage as in a garage, so I do in the future plan to, um, or my husband and I plan to make this into a room if we plan on staying here. So we'll see how that goes. Okay, moving on. Here is the deck. And we have our grill out here. And then coming down the stairs to our little open patio. It's just such, that's the dog's pool. <laughs> okay, so we put all this grass in and we made a little play area for the kids over here. We took out their swing set because they weren't using it and my boys are all older now. So we put in this pool just this year so we'll see how long that lasts. And their trampoline is still hanging strong even though it's a little tattered. And over here in the future we're going to put um, a cover and make this a nice little patio area. Because um, right now it's just all open and don't mind all the junk on the side. That's our trash pile. So this um, fort, we call it a fort, not a playhouse because we have boys. And the fort is actually something my husband built for them. Um, it still needs a little bit of paint job, but I thought it was pretty cool. And my kids love it. They play in here all the time. And they, when they have friends over and my friends have kids over, they play in here. And it's pretty cool. It's got stairs to go upstairs. I'm not going to take you up there, but that's what it looks like. That's the back of my house. And that is our little backyard inside of our yard. If that doesn't make sense, it will soon. Okay, this is our dog door that my husband built. So the doggies, we come in and out because we have it blocked off. And coming through the fence over here, this is our future garden. We actually put this in this year, or I shouldn't say we, my husband built all those planter boxes and that little pergola, which I'm still staining. I just It gets so hot out here, you guys, in the summer that I just don't want to be outside. And by the time it's nice to come out, I just want to sit in my bed and relax. So we wanted to plant a garden this um, spring but it just kind of happened a little late and all the stuff got done too late. And so we're gonna have to wait till next spring, guys. But I promise you I will have future videos on my garden because I plan on having lots and lots of vegetables and fruits. And we right now we have fruit trees. I don't know if you guys can see them. We have an apple tree, a cherry tree, peach tree, and an almond tree. So hopefully by next spring those will be bigger. And that's the front of our house. Okay, now coming around, that's my husband's tool shed. Another shed for all his garden tools. Oh my god, do you guys want to know <laughs> what we have to deal with in the desert? These tumbleweeds. Oh my goodness. And these are just all the ones we picked up from the garden area. My son was busy out here the other day. Poor thing. I mean, look at these suckers. They're huge. Tumbleweeds like crazy. So all of this is ours. We live on an acre and a quarter. Um... Uh, and it's pretty big. And then I do want horses. I love horses. We used to have goats over here. That was the goat shed. But they just got really messy and they were kind of a pointless animal if you ask me. Um, we have a chicken coop too. No more chickens right now. We, we do plan on getting chickens again. Um, we had an incident with the kids letting the dogs uh, massacre them, which is pretty sad. <laughs> so once we find a more secure way of keeping chickens, we'll get more. Um, and then that shed in the back, where is it at? I can't see. Oh, right there. Um, it's empty right now. I used to have all my husband's extra tools and building supplies, but now it's just empty. And it's for my future, like, 
horses, like a tack room. I'm so excited, but I don't know if we'll ever get horses. It's just kind of a dream that I've always had as a kid, and I have the land to do it. It's just a lot of work, and my husband's got to build a stable. I have a, hu a handy husband, so that comes in handy. And this is the back of the little play yard. That's the fort right there. So it's our little mini yard inside a yard. There's the back of the shed. And my dogs are hot. They're ready to go in. You ready to go back inside? It's hot out here, huh? You want some water? So that is our backyard, guys. So in the future, I do plan on having some new stuff next season. So like I said, my garden for sure. Um, our patio cover, hopefully. And horses maybe in the future. Chickens I do plan on getting, hopefully within the year. So we'll see how that goes. But that's just it. I just kind of wanted to give you guys an idea of what my backyard looks like. I enjoy watching other people's home tours. And I like seeing outdoors. Because not a lot of people show their outdoors. And I don't know why. I kind of enjoy it. So thanks for watching, guys. Leave a comment if you guys have any questions. <laughs> Bye.